We're winning the game. Right. We're up by eight points. And uh, one of our teammates, Derek Martin, had been a- in L.A. with Mike when he was filming Space Jams. It was the summer before. He, it was the summer after he filmed Space Jams. Okay. We're up eight. Mike is four for 16 from the field. He's having a really rough night. Right. So Derek decides, because there's about 10 minutes to go in the game and we're winning, he decides to say to Michael Jordan, who's having an off night, hey, Mike, shit's not falling tonight, Mike. You're having an off night, Mike. Really? 24 points in the last 10 minutes. <laughs> His last jump shot, this is no lie, he catches the ball in the post. He does the typical Jordan fadeaway. He's fading towards our bench. He knocks down the shot. They go up by six. He turns to the bench and says, shut up, you little bitch. <laughs> True story. Wow. True story. And if you... It's on YouTube. You can. It's. It's. I think it's '95 Grizzlies versus Bulls. You can Bulls, see it. And you can see it. It's the last shot he hits, and you see him turn to the bench, and you can't hear. You can't hear what he says. But I promise you, his words were, "Shut up, you little bitch." We go in the locker room after the game, like right. Mike has killed us. Right. Byron Scott, who's now the head coach of the Lakers was assigned to guard Michael Jordan and had been doing a great job. And then Mike lit him up for 24 points in the right. last 10 minutes of the game. He comes in the locker room. He's on fire. He walks up to Derek Martin and says, listen, don't you ever talk to the guy I'm guarding. You talk to your guy. Don't you talk. Oh, we had to break. It was almost a fight in the locker room. And well, Byron Scott's a 